Good morning to you, New Springs family. My name is Suro Oloro Shogo, and I'll be anchoring the announcements today. We would like to welcome everyone worshipping with us for the first time today, either in person or online. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. This is our way of saying welcome to church. My church is a group of people who are like family, a continuously growing church bringing health to the hurting, liberty to the captive, strength to the weak, and new life to the dying. Welcome to church, welcome to love, welcome to family. Welcome home. New Springs is a place of refuge. Vibrant worship, undiluted word of God, great family, lovely friends. If you are interested in practical Christianity, I invite you to join us. If you want to experience anything like genuine love, please come to New Springs. In New Springs, the worship experience is awesome. You practically feel the presence of God. Everyone is just like a family. They have time for each other and they're very accessible. Personally, New Springs is my second home. A place where I have been, I have been able to grow spiritually and also in terms of my career. You want a great church where you experience God's love in abundance. Come worship with us. It's a place to come and you find support. The people are amazing. There's love in abundance. Welcome home. 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 You're welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home. Welcome home to New Springs. No matter who you are, no matter where you are, pray this service encourages you. Welcome home. Welcome to New Springs. We have a gift we would like to give you. So please stop by at our Welcome Center right after service to pick up your gift or leave a comment, hashtag my first time if you're online and we'll get in touch with you. Thank you for joining us. We love you and we hope to see more of you. Our Back to School initiative driven by the women of faith, the married women, is less than a month away. Remember, you've been blessed to be a blessing. Let's put a big smile on the faces of these children by giving towards this project. Please see Mrs. Akimbayo and Mrs. Ademuago for more details. The New Springs Academy is new, exciting, and educative. It is an academy where you get to learn various skills to improve and become a better version of yourself. Watch this space as more details will be communicated. Please make sure you connect with Mr. Anosike before you leave church today because volunteers are highly needed. The long awaited relocating rights event is here. It is happening this coming Saturday, the 21st of August, August at 2 p.m. Remember to spread the news and invite as many people as you can. Hi everyone, my name is Paula Shake Fashogwe. I live in Calgary in the province of Alberta, Canada. Hi everyone, my name is Elidi Lawal and I'm based here in Michigan in the United States. Hi everyone, my name is Ruslin Udeme. I'm based here in Lancaster in the UK. Before we moved to Canada, I was on the choir at the New Springs and my husband was in the ushering department. To the glory of God, a few weeks after that, I got my first job as a customer relations specialist. Prior to moving to the US, my wife and I were members of our sister's the live stream parish. My wife was in the choir and I was the minister of evangelism. It's been about 11 years that we've now relocated to the US and it's been an awesome experience. I'm currently the managing partner and co-founder of Barra Capital Partners. If I was going to describe our relocation in one word, permit me to use three words. I would say it's been blessed, it's um, life-changing and amazing. It's been three years since I relocated and I must say that my relocation experience has been nothing but great and hard work. Prior to my relocating to the UK, I was a member of the New Springs Church. I'm a radiographer as well as an echocardiographer and I currently work with the NHS hospital. If I was going to describe relocating to Canada, you know, without, with no legal status, I would say it could be very challenging. It's very important that when you're thinking relocation, 
you are not doing it out of a win. So, life in the UK without Lagos starting can be very difficult and hard because you can't get a house, you can't get a good job, you are running from post to post, and also you cannot even get the benefits that the government would give to you. You need to sit down, you need to plan, you need to pray, you need to get prepared, you need to do your research before you jump into it because there's a wrong way to do it and there's a right way to do it. If you do it the wrong way, there are certain penalties, restrictions that exist. If you do it the right way, you can reap a lot of benefits from your relocation. So if you want to learn more, make it a date with us. On Saturday, August 21st. On Saturday, August the 21st. And the 21st of August at 2 p.m. So I look forward to seeing you all and inviting you all to join us on that Saturday. As we throw more light on the do's and don'ts of relocation. Thank you very much and God bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. See you there. Our pastor and the ministers of the New Springs family will be having a breakfast meeting to welcome all our new members and tell them what the church is all about and where our new members can ask specific questions also about the church. Date is Saturday, the 28th of August at 10 a.m. If you've been worshiping with us for the last three months or longer and you haven't attended our welcome session, kindly put down your name with our church growth personnel, Bosse Oluwadara, right after the service so an invitation can be sent to you. Date again is 28th of August and the time is 10 a.m. Our worship experience, or will be holding this same Saturday, the 28th of August by 5 p.m. This is a worship session where we come and give all our worship to God and experience his manifold presence. Date again is Saturday, 28th of August, and time is 5 p.m. Venue, church auditorium, and our online channels. Please make it a date and invite your friends and families. Please remember to join your Connect Center or small group meeting today from 5 p.m. If you don't already belong to one, please feel free to connect with Pastor B.C. Adenuga after the service. Remember to join the weekly World Quest service and push service this week as we continue in our theme for the month, New Heights. Ensure you make it a date for the two services. And as usual, the services will hold here in church and online on our Facebook and YouTube pages by 6 p.m. Also remember to connect to our weekly Wednesday Zoom prayers for all round fruitfulness, especially for families believing God for the fruit of the womb on Wednesday at 6 p.m. The Zoom details will be communicated in the course of the week. Thank you for listening to the announcement. God bless you and have a glorious week ahead in Jesus' name.